Uh, something else. You were both uh, child actors. Is there a lot of? Is that because of you? You grew up in in LA, and uh, well, how, how did you get in that business, both of you? Circumstance, really. I think we both talked a lot as kids. <laughs> they couldn't shut us up. And is it that your parents just uh, sent you to uh, do an audition? Or? Yeah, mine did. Yeah. Um, did yours? Yeah. I mean, I, yours was more of you kind of decided. Well, I grew up. In, I grew up in San Diego, and we had a an, a family friend who had a daughter who was acting, and my mom had always put me in theater, like as a kid. So um, she said, you know, I should try that, and I did. It was fun. It was a good time. Yeah, it was a good time. What was the good thing about it? I got to meet Michael J. Fox. I got to meet Michael Landon. <laughs> um, I uh, I got to hang out with. John Lithgow. I don't know, that's pretty fun. I, when I was a kid, I, I thought Family Ties was the coolest show in the world. I thought Michael J. Fox was, there was nobody cooler in the whole world. And then I got to do two episodes of that show as his like cousin. And to me, that was, at that moment, you couldn't have, you couldn't have offered me a more perfect gift. So I can never give that back. I have that, that's, that's amazing to me in that moment, you know? Yeah. Um, so. That was pretty cool. I don't know, what was your coolest? Jenny, did you like it? What was your best, best time? I had good times. Uh, I got to miss school a bunch, which is pretty great when you're a kid. It's pretty good. Um, no, I, I had some really positive experiences and then ultimately kind of discovered that perhaps, you know, making my own decisions as an adult it's probably the best path. Okay, so you, you both, you didn't have ambitions to be actors as grown-ups? I, I, I didn't, no, not as uh, an adult. I, I was not enjoying it at all. I, no? I, I didn't enjoy it at all. I, I'm not, I, no. But you got to hang out with Michael J. Fox. Yeah, when I was a kid, but as, I, as you grow older, I, you just start to look at your life in a different, you know, perspective, and, and acting wasn't what I was looking forward to when I was doing it. So it didn't seem fair to continue doing something that's someone else's dream, just because it's available to me or something, and it was making me sad. Okay. <laughs> so, so, at what age did you did you stop? You both? In our late teens, it started to taper off. Yeah. Okay. All right. Um, well, thank you very much. Hey, 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 hey. Seeburen. Oh, look Good at that life. boat. I got a move. Look at that boat. Hey, you there. I want a boat like that. He's a boating kind of guy. I like he a wants boat. to live on a boat. Yeah. I want to live on a boat. Do you have a boat? No, I don't have a boat. <laughs> what I if you had a boat? boat? It'd be sweet. Go live in the marina? Little raft with a little oh, engine. Oh, a little. That'd be sweet, man. I'd like to. I don't know, but your mom's boat didn't seem that sweet. Yeah, my mom lived on a boat. Didn't seem that sweet. Some kind of. It was not a. It's kind of like a ghetto there's, boat. Yeah, there's no shower. I don't know. I don't, I don't think. I, I think I'd miss plumbing. Hey. Okay. 